Horse riding on Deauville's beach, but not the usual kind. The famous French resort has been closed off by 12,000 police, three times the number of regular residents. For the GHG20 summit, security is paramount. The usually bustling upscale holiday destination has become a ghost town. Even those who live here need special badges to get into the center, and that's not necessarily to their liking. It's strange. We don't feel this is our home anymore. It feels like in wartime. <laughs> It's hard to get into Deauville and hard to get out. Police are still relaxed, but the checks for motorists are strict. Across the bridge and neighboring Trouville, life was supposed to go on as usual, but businesses here are also feeling the summit pinch. People prefer to stay home rather than go out. Usually we'd expect to serve 150 or 200 meals on a day like today, but we'll just reach 80. So our turnover has been cut in half. But in Deauville's town hall, they hope that the huge foreign influx for the summit will end up being a great boon to the economy. Hoteliers, restaurant owners and shops will have 10,000 foreigners visiting and discovering our city for two days. Happy with the summit or not, Deauville's residents are looking forward to the weekend when the circus will have left town and they'll finally have their famous beach all to themselves again.